Welcome back to the Transport Bandit channel. I'm Cheryl. I'm Jeff. Or today, Mr. I'm more like Mr. Dimples. Mr. Dimples. Show me your taking, dimples, Mr. Dimples. There they are, right there. Because we're taking a reset. We're on reset. You know what reset means. That means after every seven or eight right. days when you've used your 70 hour clock, you are forced to take a 34 hour reset. But guess where we're taking our reset? Here on Vancouver Island. Vancouver Island. So I'm happy. We're happy. We are rid of our camper. If you watched the last video. We're going further north. We are headed to Campbell River. Yep. I've got a rundown on a great seafood restaurant. Fish and chips. And we have a Comfort Inn Hotel. Yep. A suite. Waiting on us. That overlooks the ocean. With a balcony. That overlooks the ocean. It's going to be magical. Magical. <laughs> and I got it for free. That's why it's magical. Yeah! And how did I get it for free? We're a member of that Choice Privileges um, Rewards Program. So every time you stay in a hotel, you get points. And every time we, we have the credit card. So everything that we use on our credit card that is in our fuel discount comp data card, Every time we buy something, it gives us some points. So we've racked up plenty of points. Yeah. Cheryl calls it free. I call it when you spend enough money, they'll just give you something. Yeah, get a perk for spending a lot of money. <laughs> we don't spend that much money, but we have a lot of points left over from when we used to do the art shows because we stayed at hotels all the time. In any case, we are headed north on Vancouver Island. They say this is the most, one of the most remote places. Um, not remote, but uh, what do you call it? Unplugged. Yeah. They called it unplugged. Okay. So one there's... of the most remote, harshest environments on the planet. <laughs> uh, they have grizzly bear. Grizzly bear. They I have don't... mountain lions and elk. And elk um, and mountains on the island here. Um, I don't know if we're going to see any. We're going to go look anyway, but we might see some beautiful waterfalls. You know, I can almost guarantee you, Cheryl, we're going to see a mountain lion fighting a grizzly bear over who gets to eat the baby elk. <laughs> um, I can whether do without we, that. Thank whether you. Whether <laughs> we get this on, whether we get this on video or not. <laughs> yeah, well, you just won't get it on video. I don't know. Video. It's unlikely. It'll be happening. You just won't see it. Right? It's unlikely <laughs> we'll get it on video. All right. This could turn into the National Geographic Channel. So, um... Okay, so follow us on our journeys. We're headed north of Vancouver Island up to Campbell River tonight where we look to go out onto the pier and get us some fish and chips to start our evening off with. Then we've got our room overlooking the ocean. Yep. And then tomorrow, fun day on the island. It's not like a grass skirt, your toes in the sand type no, island. that's a shame because I'm kind of fond of coconut bras and grass, grass skirts. <laughs> Yeah, I'm fond of that. Yeah, that's not up here. That's not this kind of island. This is a no, it's going to be extreme more like, northwest island, kind of going yeah, towards the Alaska. Women, yeah, the women dancing are going to be in parkas and sweater pants. <laughs> yeah. It's not that cold. We have a gorgeous day here on the island. Right now, it's almost sunset, and it's uh, 50 degrees. So it's gorgeous. We'll take it. It's a lot better than that minus 20 where our fuel stuff gelled up. So yes. We'll take it. All right, let's head on up the road. 19, up Vancouver Island to Campbell River. Let's go. Let's see what we can find, see what we can get into. And Band you need, let's do some banditing. Yes, we're going to do some bandity stuff. Bandity stuff. And you need, you really need to subscribe. Subscribe. All right, listen. This subscription business, okay? It doesn't cost you anything. Not it a thing. Does, it doesn't harass you. You see that little red button that, or, or the words that say subscribe? Just click on it. Yeah. That gets us in a subscriber. It costs you nothing. The only thing that does is like yeah. it increases our subscriber. Yeah, it doesn't hurt for you. YouTube. It doesn't hurt to affect you at all. And unless you hit that notification bell, the little bell that's underneath here, like down there, hit that notification bell and it will tell you on your phone when we're going live or we have another new video up. That's right. the only thing that is. You can subscribe. And Don't be scared to subscribe. Right. It won't hurt you at all. It makes Cheryl happy. It makes me happy. And when Cheryl's happy, I'm less irritated. <laughs> You're less irritated. Good. I like it. 
like a, I like a less irritated Mr. Dimples. You don't feel like ripping any heads off today, do you? No, I'm pretty happy today. Well, and this is Mr. Bones. If you haven't met Mr. Bones, this is our traveling companion, Mr. Bones. You know, Cheryl, as long as I don't run into any narwhals up here, I think I'll stay in a pretty good mood. Awesome. <laughs> just, if you know, and you know who you, you are, you know Jeff doesn't have a thing for narwhals. He's a little scared of them, I think. You know that big horn? That's an actual animal. Check this out. Uh, but we may see one because we're going to be right there on the ocean. That's not going to work for me. <laughs> no narwhals. Alrighty then. Let's look for a grizzly's elk and, and a kraken. And a kraken. We can look for a kraken. Yeah. yeah. Alright, let's go do something bandity. Let's go. See you. In case you didn't know, I'm a pretty big guy. This is what a can of Coke looks like in my hand. <laughs> it's a tiny Coke. Yeah, you know. It's a very tiny Coke. Coke has always tasted better. Look at this tiny Coke. Yeah, it's, it's always tasted Coke. better in tiny cans and tiny bottles. What about at Christmas time when you get those Cokes in the in the balls? Oh, they're delicious. With the, with the white bears on. Those are the best tasting Coke. No, I know what the best tasting Coca-Cola is. It's the tiny glass bottle. The tiny glass bottle. Okay. There's that bit of information. Look what you'll learn here on the Transport Panda Channel. Sorry. Uh -huh. Columbia River on Vancouver Island sits on the 50th parallel. I don't know what that means exactly. It's like half of the continent of the North American it's continent. It's halfway to the North Pole from the equator. That's it. See? We know something. the urchins. Wow. Well, thank, thank you guys. Thanks guys. Have a good night. Hey, take a look at this First Nation total poll. Like three of them here. Okay. We're gonna go over here to the Riptide. Let's go have some seafood. Here we are at uh, Riptides. The fisherman down on the pier told us about this place. And then somebody out in the parking lot said this was the best place to come get some fish and chips. So we're gonna try it. Let's go. Okay, we're inside the Riptide and look what we ordered. Here. Oh, I got the salmon. Jeff got the fish and chips. Take a look. <laughs> if you guys never had sockeye salmon, it's fantastic. It's a lot more pinker or reddisher than regular salmon. But it's delicious. When I was in Alaska, I caught a lot of sockeye salmon. Take a look at this picture that Jeff caught. Good. I don't know what is going on here. But that is probably the most unusual looking Medusa mermaid woman I've ever seen. Not sure about that right there. Okay, how was that meal? It was good. It was really good. Let's head to the hotel. Um, 
it comes with a table and chairs. We have the sink and the and the refrigerator, microwave, coffee maker. It's living quarters here and TV. And if it was in daytime, which it will be tomorrow, we would have a view of the marina there. But uh, here, I'll take you on a tour over here. And there's a separate room here. Yeah. <laughs> that was really loud. We have a separate room here of the bedroom. And it has a balcony. It has the view. We'll see what that looks like tomorrow. And this is the bathroom area. Very nice. Plenty of towels. Let's turn on the light. There we go. It's very clean, very nice. This is the Comfort Inn in Campbell River. Good morning. Good morning. It's morning. <laughs> this is the view from our room. We're going to leave here now and go explore and have a fun day on the island. Reset on the island. Yeah, let's you do know, it. I think it would be funner if it was summer. It would be funner if it was summer. But it's not. It's a, But it's nice outside. It's beautiful. Let's go. That's about it. This is remote, Jeff. Oh, there's some houses there. They have a, uh, a train. They have a train here in Was. It was affectionately known as the Loki Steam Locomotive. It remains an important part of the history and the community of Was. Its last logging run took place in 1966 in the Nipkish Valley. We're in beautiful Was in the Nipkish Valley, Was Lake and Bonanza Range. So Was and Was Lake is in the center of the Nipkish Valley and this is definitely known for logging. We're exploring today. That's what we love to do. Let's just get out there and see what's around the next bend. Okay, we're coming into the village of Telegraph Cove. Remember, this is all logging industry areas up here. Telegraph Cove Marina and RV Park. Port McNeil is just 10 kilometers from the turnoff to Telegraph Cove. The Nipkish River. First place we've seen to really get gas. And regular gas is 191.8 a liter. Heli Hansen wear here. That's a really good name brand for outdoor gear. Extreme weather clothing. I'm in the driver's seat. I'm going to be driving back to uh, where are we going back to? Campbell River area? Going back to civilization. Yep. Um, we've had enough exploring up here. Well, it's getting late, so, and I want to see the Elk Falls Provincial Park which is uh, supposed to be pretty spectacular with a suspension bridge over the falls. So we're going to drive on back down there so I can see that before it gets dark. 
So we did some food. We didn't make it all the way to Port Hardy. There's not much. This is so remote. It's like going to Alaska. I mean, there's really not a whole lot um, in the town lights kind of thing of uh, attractions. Well, it's winter time. It might be more in the summertime. I don't think so. Don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we are going to turn around and head back to Campbell River. Okay, we made it to Elk Falls Provincial Park and Suspension Bridge. Isn't it suspenseful? Apparently, this is going to include some walking. Um, if it turns into hiking, we're going to have problems. I think it might. Take a look. Looks like it's going to go off into the woods. Let's go. Okay, Elk Falls is located off of Highway 28, about five miles from Campbell River. And it's beautiful here. Now, if you watched our previous videos, you'll know that I had an app that would make Cheryl more enamored with me and love me. And one of the things that it suggested was hiking. Now, I took Cheryl on four extended hikes. So <laughs> now here I am again. It's beautiful Why? here. Why? <laughs> it's beautiful. Let's take a hike. Look at this. We could have just drove out here to the bridge. <laughs> There's a road that the trail crosses. <laughs> plenty of parking here. I could have just drove out here. The road. This is not the suspension bridge. Here's a bridge. It's a footbridge. It's suspended over something, but there's no water. Look, it's dry. This is not it. This is just part of the trail. And back into the woods. I don't know. Let's see. Today is March 4th, so we should be okay. So Charles says, come on, honey, you can walk a little faster. I just don't see what the benefit is for me. I mean, I did that in Yellowstone when I had that app to make her enamored with me. It gave me no benefit at all. So, no, I'm just gonna stroll along. Use the least amount of energy as possible. I gotta make it out of here alive. There's the suspension bridge. The falls would be right down there. Here we go. Wow, those are really rushing. We're here. We're here. We're here. Look at this. This is awesome. Jeff. Oh, brother. This is ridiculous. Get up. This is terrible. I got a good picture of you though. Got good falls in the background. The bridge is really bouncy too. Okay, Jeff, is this the fun side of RV transport or what? Oh yeah, yeah, <laughs> it is. It's the fun side of RV transport. Yeah. I can see you. <laughs> All right. Now my, now my thighs are itching. Wait, what are you doing? My thighs are itching. Your thighs are itching. You know, like when you ride a riding lawnmower and your fat itches. <laughs> your fat itches. Yeah, my fat's itching everywhere. <laughs> oh, I'm allergic to hockey. Yes, you are. <laughs> Stop that. Hey, don't forget, if you like this video, hit that like button. And subscribe.
You didn't have any gusto behind that oh, one. No, there's no gusto left. I'm dying. <laughs> Man, that's a long ways back to the truck. We're just walking slightly uphill. Oh no, there's a road right there. They can't put a parking lot here. <laughs> Okay, so if you like the video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, comment, share, whatever you want to do. I'll check you out later. Let's go get something to eat. We are at Duke's. The advertisement said big plates of steak. That's all I need to know. So, I'm here at Duke's. You see? And I just ordered what was referred to as a big plate of steak. <laughs> big plate of steak. <laughs> Come on, that's got to be good. <laughs> All right, Charles, what'd you get? I got the Duke's mac and cheese, not like your mom used to make. Because I'm a mac and cheese freak. All right, we're both happy. I'm a steak freak, you're a mac and cheese freak. Mac and cheese. We'll see if we leave there happy. Okay. This is a kind of a local place here in Campbell River. It's not kind of a local place. It is a local place. You know what? It's, um, there's nobody in here right now because it's 3.45 p.m. So it's too early for dinner, too yeah. late for lunch. But yeah. we're starving. So we couldn't wait. That's right. So we're going to have sup lunch. Sup lunch. Yeah. <laughs> lunch. A, a lunch, a lumper. Right. We're having a lumper. That's right. <laughs> a lumper. Right. Bye. So, I got my big plate of steak. That's a big plate of steak. It is. You got the prime rib Saturday special? Yes. Yorkshire pudding, baked potato, and vegetables with holiday sauce, and look at mine. I've got the Duke's big macaroni and cheese, not like your mama's. <laughs> All right, so this has been the Funside RV Transport today. Even though we were in the wilderness and there wasn't nothing there that was fun. <laughs> um, you I didn't did, love the waterfall? I did get a big plate of steak. All right. I don't really remember the waterfall. I think I passed out. <laughs> you passed out on the bridge. <laughs> yeah. From the walk. <laughs> Yeah, from the hike. It was too much of a train and I just passed out there, so I don't really... I blacked out about halfway through the hike. <laughs> yeah. All right, thank you for joining us. Um, this has been our fun side of RV transport, because remember, when you drop that trailer, or you have to do a reset, time is your own. You can right. explore, have a fun day like we are, and, and just have what, a good time. That's, that's what it's about. Yeah, and that's what we do, you know. And with Synergy, it's a nice, relaxed atmosphere real happy with that yeah so if you're thinking of applying to RV transport and you apply to synergy remember to put our names down transport bandits um, as a referral on your application it'll help you and it'll help me yeah it will and it'll help us. yeah it will it sure will thank you so, so much you guys have a great day fun evening whatever you're doing enjoy the videos and subscribe yes yeah, subscribe all right that's it for us transport bandits out, out.